Hey guys, it's Jen from Illustrator How. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about the artboard basics in Illustrator. So you will be learning how to create a new artboard, how to move artboard, how to arrange artboard. So yeah, everything about artboards. If that sounds interesting to you, please keep watching this video. Okay guys, so let me show you how to use artboards in Illustrator. And obviously we're going to begin with how to create a new artboard. So when you create a new document, actually you'll be creating only one artboard. So if you want to create multiple artboards, uh, you should actually create that from the beginning when you create a new document. So uh, if you go to File, New, choose Artboard Size. I'm going to choose this one that I just created. And here, as you can see, the number of artboards, you can put uh, as many artboards as you want. If you want to create, let's say, five artboards, just put five. And in your new documents, you will see five artboards. And what about if you want to create new artboards as you are working on your project? Well, that's really, really easy as well. You can open the artboard panel from window, artboards. And here, as you can see, there's a plus icon, new artboard. Simply just click on that. And if you just keep clicking on that, you are going to create multiple artboards. Otherwise, uh, you can also create new artboards from the properties panel under uh, document and you can see an option edit artboard and if you click on that here next to the artboard name, you will also see a new artboard icon and just click on that. You will be creating new artboards as well. All right, that's a lot of artboards. I'm going to delete them. So yeah, and here's how you can delete an artboard. If you have an artboard selected with the artboard tool, if you don't know this tool exists, so simply click on that and delete the artboard that you want to delete. And if you want to delete multiple artboards, the easiest way is just to select the artboard that you want to delete from the artboards panel. You can hold the shift key and choose the artboards you want to delete and hit the delete button and leaving just one artboard. And that's the easiest way. And if you have a bunch of empty artboards, a very quick way to do so is just to go to the hidden menu and choose delete empty artboards. Well, actually all the artboards are empty, but you will always have one artboard left in your uh, Illustrator file. All right, and if you want to change the artboard size, you can, with the artboard tool selected, you can uh, simply just click and drag to resize the artboard. Very, very easy. Or with the artboard selected, you can also change the artboard size here. Uh, the width and height, you put 200. Well, this is a manual input. I never use it unless I know the exact size. So let me maybe create something on the artboard. Okay, let's say I create a cloud wall randomly and then I want to duplicate this artboard. So there are also a couple of ways to do that. You can select the artboard that you want to duplicate and then choose the hidden menu and choose duplicate artboards. And you can see it duplicates your artboard and it shows artboard one copy. And you can also click and drag it to the new artboard icon. And it's also going to duplicate your artboard. And there's another way to do it. You can select the artboard tool, hold the shift and option key and drag the artboard. I know that can look super confusing and that's why sometimes you do need to name your artboard. So if you want to rename your artboard, simply double click on the artboard name, uh, cloud one. So how do you know which one, which artboard is which? That's very easy to tell. As you can see here on top of the artboard, when you have multiple artboards, um, besides showing the name here, you can also see the sequence number on the top left of your artboard. So zero three, as you can see, there are four artboards, zero four. And if you want to rearrange the sequence, you can cl click and drag it above or under to rearrange your artboard or you can go to the hidden menu choose rearrange all artboards and here you can uh, arrange a layout from the layout order as well like however you want yeah so you can rearrange your artboard like this but i think that's pretty much it and here if you want to change the arrangement again you can click on that 
And yeah, that's pretty much it. If you want to learn more about Illustrator Basics, I do have a beginner's course where I talk about all Illustrator Basics that you should know as a beginner. And I will also cover some advanced stuff at the end of the course, including logo design, typography design, and uh, how to create a portfolio. So if you're interested, I will have the link to my course in the description below. All right, so that's pretty much it. As always, if you find this video helpful, don't forget to give me a thumb up and hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss any of my future tutorials. And oh, if you want to get more graphic design tips or illustrator tips, you can also sign up my weekly newsletter that I will be sending out like tips and hacks of Adobe Illustrator and graphic design in general.